Hi, Patrick here. Uh, eight, uh, uh, half cheetah will view. Eight questions with, and uh, so yeah. Um, I guess the crow trailer has dropped, uh, and uh, me and the cheetah we took a look at it, and um, you know it's probably one of the more highly anticipated movies of the year. Um, you know the beloved cult classic starring uh, uh, Brandon Lee and and a cast of a uh, very very well known icons and um so many good actors in the first movie and um again beloved beloved for brendan lee who who died during the uh during the filming of the movie uh so i watched the, the the trailer for the new one and these are just my thoughts on top of my head um yeah i hate to say it like this man but i'm not impressed at all uh, the trailer is not very good. The movie might be far better than the trailer, but you won't know it by watching the trailer. Um, the first thing I would notice right away, um, as far as the trailer goes, is if the origin story seems to be the same, but there's absolutely no soul to it. Um, I think part of that has to do with the music they use for the trailer. This looks. This is coming across as... Just a, just a, a wham bam. Thank you, man. Do you know that fight? All they showed was just fight, fight, fight. And in the crow, there was a lot of time. In the first crow, as you notice, you know he wasn't a uh, he wasn't a skilled fighter. He was a musician, and um and you know and he he had to stumble his way or you know to discovering his powers. Eric Draven did. Here, Bill Skarsgård looks like he's already ready to whip that candy ass from the from the get go. Um, you know, I'm going to kill every one of them. Oh, we haven't heard that line in a, a hundred movies. Um, and again, the music in this movie, it's all wrong. It should be dark. It should be gothic. It should be slow and sluggish. It shouldn't be upbeat. It shouldn't be a rock, you know, even though Eric Draven was a rocker, but it shouldn't be a fast rocker. And it's damn near shouldn't have, should not have synthesizer drums. Ugh. Um, the cast is Bill Skarsgård and Danny Houston. Uh, never heard of anybody else other than in the cast. Shockingly, shockingly so. Uh, looking at the cast and I'm like, I don't know any of these people at all. Um, and that tells me that the budget for this movie is not very good. It's very, going to be very, it's going to be low budget. They're going to try to make a hit out of a low budget film. I'm not so sure that's going to work either. Um... I think it would have been helpful to have some faces that we all know other than Danny Houston and uh, and, and Bill Skarsgård. I just not getting a good feeling for this movie. I I don't think it's going to be I don't think it's going to be well received. I don't think it should have I don't think they should have made it to tell you the truth. Um I just don't. I think this is one of those movies that you just left alone um and moved on to something else. So not impressed with the crow trailer. Doesn't the movie doesn't doesn't look like it's gonna be that good. I'm gonna take a hard pass on this. And um I don't know. What do you think? Uh drop a comment down below. Tell us your pros and cons of the new crow. If you're if you're pumped for it, if you're if you're like me, you're sort of pessimistic. Uh, yeah, let's let's talk about it. Alright, well we will see you soon. Peace.